like every man on this beach is after my body. It's after my body. It's after my body. Hello, and welcome back to Numbskull. Today, we're going to talk about Tinder. in a different way something's wrong with our eyes So, where are we with this douchebag situation? The thing about douchebags is that they tend to cluster. It's true. Our algorithm is showing hard clustering. In some demos, they travel in packs. We've got a solution. Bring me someone with real douchebag experience, and I'll show you how it works. Who can we call? I've got this. Go right in. They're expecting you. No, no, no. Don't worry about it. This is for you. Hey, welcome to Tinder. Douchebag expert at your service. So I've noticed Tinder's putting out a whole bunch of new ads that are popping up on YouTube videos all over the place. And these ads, for the most part, don't bother me in and of themselves. But I'm seeing so many of them, it just seems kind of... What's the word I'm looking for? for sexist that's it there's this actress comedian douchebag miss whitney cummings <laughs> and she's supposed to do what now I explain or be explained to about what a douchebag is or how to find one or how to not find one i'm i'm, I'm confused does anybody know what a douchebag is anybody you in the back left row, do you know what a douchebag is? It's to wash your badge. <laughs> What's funny is, you're right. That's exactly what it is. That's what it's used for. That's what they're called. A douchebag is to wash out your badge. So, are you looking for one, or are you calling men one? In which case, I don't know if we should really be offended, you know. Okay, moving on. All right, ladies, listen up. It's our job to make sure we give all the women in the world the tools they need to fight douchiness. Anytime, anywhere. New from Summer's Eve, the travel size, leak-proof douchebag. Douche bag. And Whitney's dealt with a lot of douchebags in her life. A lot. The last guy I dated had calf implants. So we all agree that calling out douchebags should be easy and fun. Mm -hmm. So let's show Whitney new Tinder reactions. Oh, genius. Like, oh my god, did you see the new cartoon logos that you can send people? I don't know if anybody knows what they mean, so we'll have to send a bunch of words with them, but we can send pictures with the words, and we can do all sorts of cool things on our phone now, and it's really important when it comes to dating because we can do all this talking before we actually get together with a person, and there's so much other stuff we can do. Now, uh, uh, what else is there to say? Wait, because he was charging his vape. Mm -hmm. I like this. Really? And next, we have our intermediate douche. This is the guy that lists his expectations right in his bio. He's into fitness, and you should be too. Remember guys, don't list exactly who you are and what you want because women don't want that. Hashtag no days off guy. And lastly, here we have our advanced douche. So this one uses eggplant emojis as his opener and dinner's on me, baby, come hungry as his closer. <sighs> Just felt my uterus tilt inside my body. Need to sit down and straighten it out. Yeah, because it's appropriate to talk about your uterus in a business meeting. Wow, that this ad just seems stupid to me. Maybe it's just because I'm a guy and I'm being referred to as a douchebag again, which I don't really see to have too much of a problem with. But let's move on to the next commercial. I'm going to cut and chop a couple of these that I found, and we'll, we'll see what else I have to show you. Product testing now in session. Test subject 4792. I am having a day. This loser runs into my convertible when I'm coming out of spin class. And get this, the guy was eating carbs while he was driving. Hey, can we cue the eye roll reaction? Q 
cue the eye roll reaction. Girl, that dress looks good, but that green is ugly. And why did none of you change your clothes? And you got this jock in here with a bunch of women trying to hit on you, and you're going to roll your eyes. Come on. Mm. One of my subs is going to have to help me. I've never used Tinder. I'm married. I've been with the person for a long time. So, as I'm trying to proceed, do I swipe right or swipe left to get past this? I, I think it's right. We'll go right. I know we're supposed to go out this weekend, but do we have to go dancing? I mean, Saturday is leg day. Deploying chivalry enhancer. You know what, on second thought, I'll just work it out on the dance floor. Okay, I like him. I'm not even sure what I just saw there. Product Next. Now in session, test subject number 4962. Hey, ladies. What are you up to? Um, you know what? Let's give him the compliment generator. Starting. Whitney, I love your dress. Is that kale green? Kale green. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> and, what? and those shoes. Stop. Your skin is just luminous and glowing. Gosh. Like, as soon and as possible. You look so fertile. Begging you to stop. Something Disabling. Different. Thank you. Okay, that one's not ready to ship yet. I feel violated. Product testing now in session. Test subject number 4972. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. You too. I feel like we have quite a bit in common. Yeah, what are you up to Saturday? We should... Uh, come on, come on! Did I just get ghosted? Yes, yes, I believe you did. Probably because you're hot, you're a stuck-up bitch, and you're wearing the same dress you've been for the last four commercials. But we'll proceed anyway. Launching the Ghostbuster? Get brunch. I know the perfect place. Oceanside, bottomless mimosas. What do you say? I'd say I will also be bottomless. I will also be bottomless. Take a shower and change your clothes and this sounds good. You sound like my type. Dude, I'm gonna work out at the gym. Then I'm gonna pull my red convertible up on top of the hill. I'm gonna drop my shades and stare at the moon, bruh. Like. Subscribe, hit the alerts, share this video. I'll see you next time.